will have probably seen or heard at least one version of the Phantom of the Opera, but whether or not you are a fan of the musical, you should read the excellent novel. The book was extremely interesting and quite provoking. As so many people would definitely recommend the book to anyone who is a fan of classic literature or even to the Broadway musical, I have decided to let you know a piece of the history. The Phantom of the Opera is a novel by the French author Gaston Leroux. It was first published in book from 1910. The book is about a Parisian opera house that is haunted by a mysterious phantom. It is a story about the romance, obsession, suspense and The novel moves on to tell the life story of Christine Dae, daughter of a talented violinist who was born in Sweden but had to move to rural France when her father died. When Christine's father died, he promised her to send angel of music from heaven to help. Christine found work at the Paris Opera House. Soon after her arrival, she started to hear a voice that singed and spoke to her. When Christine asked the voice if it was the angel of music, the voice was really that of Eric, the phantom of the opera. With Eric's help, Christine's voice improved. For many years, the phantom had been extorting money from the opera house management, but the two new managers had recently taken control of the opera house and refused to give in to the demands of August. After having passed time in between each other, Eric told Christine that he was her angel of music. His initial plan was to keep the young woman with him for a few weeks, in the hope that she would fall in love with him. Found herself becoming attracted to the phantom, but everything changed when she took off his mask and saw that he had a face like a rotting Tim corpse. Tim felt sorry for Eric and wanted to sing on stage for him one last time. A man, known to everyone in the opera house as the Persian, talked with Christine's friend and explained that he was a police inspector and Eric was an whole adversary of his. When Christine learned that Raoul, her friend, and the Persian, the inspector, had been taken prisoner by the phantom, she agreed to marry him on the condition that he freed them. He was moved to tears when Christine kissed him back. He allowed Christine to leave and advised her to marry Raoul, her friend. Three weeks later, a newspaper from Paris carried an announcement that simply read, Eric is dead.